Hi everyone, Assalamualaikum and welcome back to today's video. So, I'm going to be sharing with you on how I take care of my skin. Uh, yeah, my skin is not perfect but it keeps improving from time to time. Especially my complexion and my scars, you know, my uh, redness uh, due to my acne. I will tell you what are the products that works on my skin. I have normal skin types sometimes it's normal sometimes it tends to be dry I don't know after I get married uh, the skin condition is kind of uh, changing I don't know as time goes by being a mother of three and I'm still breastfeeding my little daughter somehow it does affect how my skin condition looks like firstly I want you to know that I am NOT a skincare expert I use the product that really works on me. I keep on trying few products before, it didn't work on me. But now, I found uh, selected products that really work good on my skin. So yeah, and this is not a sponsorship review or sponsorship skincare product. This is my honest skincare routine. And this is also genuinely my experience of using them. It really works on me. And this is what I do to have better skin. Not perfect, but better. Okay, let's get started. I want to show you how I cleanse my face. Yeah, of course, we have to cleanse our face every day. I'm using Cayman Cold Face Cleanser. I heard that this cleanser works best on sensitive skin. So I kind of having sensitive skin as well. Before this, I use Clean and Clear, but it doesn't work on me so, so good lately. So I decided to change my cleanser. It's been three months I'm using this. Actually, three months before my sister wanted to buy their serum. So I took a chance to try out their new cleanser. I bought trial size at that time. I remember at that time I bought their trial size. So um, yeah, I just told myself that why not just give it a try because the clean and clear cleanser does not work on me so so good. So I put on trialably and then I test it out for a few days and it works really wonderful. It doesn't dry out my skin and even after I cleanse my face, it feels moisturized. Dia tak rasa macam after cleansing tu kita rasa tegang macam tu tak ada tau. It feels moisturized on skin. I'm so macam happy and like I found out the true products that really works on me and it's not expensive. It's affordable. Seriously guys, it is affordable. I'm not trying to promote this product but this does work on me on my sensitive skin. So if you have normal skin and dry skin, I think this cold face cleanser would work best on you if you're trying to find the new cleanser for your face. Okay, that's it for cleanser. After cleansing my face, I will use Innisfree Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask. Okay, this is for pore cleansing solution. I'm not using this every day. It's just that in a week, I will use it like two times. Yeah, two, like two days in a week, I will use this uh, pore cleansing solution. It's really important for us to cleanse our pores like if you tak nak buat hari-hari pun tak apa it means like um, seminggu tu dalam dua kali pun kira okay lah for me it's okay and I read that the mud mask can be used every day I'm not sure it's up to you but for me um, it's not necessary to use it every day but this one I nak cerita pasal Innisfree Super Volcanic Pore Clay Mask ni It's good When I first apply on my face, it feels so cool, hydrating And I use it for a few weeks now And it feels like my skin looks good My dark scars, my dark area were kind of Lama-lama, um, semakin lama, semakin pudar So that's good and I really like that uh, Yeah, I have nothing to say about this pore cleansing <laughs> Solution basically you can use whatever pore cleansing mud mask for your skin. Uh, it's just you need to try it out whether it's suitable with your skin or not. So for me, this Innisfree Super Volcanic works great and wonderful on my skin. Actually, I'm like just uh, not cuba je dulu. So kalau tak sesuai, I can stop. But then there's no negative sides happening on my skin. So I just continue using it until now. Basically, you can use or try out any brand that you think works on you. So after I cleansing my face using this matte mask, I will apply Cayman Serum. It's called Cayman Skin Tela Serum. And this serum is so wonderful. I 
tell you guys this is so wonderful it's fast absorbing I pakai sikit je actually tapi dia boleh cover uh, all the areas of my face and then it leaves kind of moisturizing feel so dia meresap ke kulit but it's not totally gone dia macam after you applying it it's absorbed but it has a slight moisture kalau you pernah guna you tahu macam mana nak cakap so yeah that's my experience of using Cayman Skin Tala Serum. This works so so good and the main ingredient is honey. Atas silap I, main ingredient is honey and um, green tea. So yeah, I know some of us or many of us tak sesuai dengan some of the ingredients even though it's just, you know, it's just cucumber, it's just honey, it's just green tea. But yeah, our skins are different. Some orang ada sensitivity masing-masing. So for me, I'm not sensitive to this kind of ingredient, honey and the green tea. And actually, sebenarnya I ni cepat terpengaruh because before this, I saw this Cayman Beauty line was so viral on Twitter. And then lepas tu, my sister pun beli dia punya cleanser and then I pun macam ikut terpengaruh juga. So I try the product. If you have sensitive skin, normal or dry skin or oily skin, please do try out their products. I mean. It's so affordable, you can try it, okay? And then they come out with travel size. So, kalau tak berkesan pun mungkin tak rugi sangat lah for me. Okay, that's it for serum. And then, after I'm applying the serum, I will use my Honeybee Venom Moisturizer. Okay, this is my favorite moisturizer. Okay, seriously. Uh, and this moisturizer sebenarnya sesuai dengan uh, dry skin. But if you have oily skin, you boleh guna juga. But it's just a tiny amount lah. Sebab this is not uh, water based moisturizer. This is a gel type moisturizer which works on dry skin or normal skin well. But yeah, uh, for all skin types pun sebenarnya sesuai je moisturizer ni. And I've tried this moisturizer on my few clients before when I do a makeup job. And many of my clients give their positive feedback and saying that their makeup lasts longer. So. Dia macam 2 in 1. I beli ni sebab nak jadikan primer and moisturizer. So, dia macam jimat sikit lah kat situ. So, basically in my skincare routine, these are the products that I usually use. Sebenarnya lagi macam scrub and then other serum yang I pakai juga tapi jarang. But for this video, I will emphasize on what are the products that I use usually. So, macam consistent. Right, kita bagi tahu apa yang kita selalu pakai and then kita show what are the outcomes of our skin condition. So I guess that's all for my skincare routine review on this video. Thank you guys for watching this video and dengar I'm a baby so habis. So if you're the one that looking for something that works on you, maybe you can consider my ideas and what I apply on my everyday routine. Yeah, in this life, kita memang kena cuba try and error. That's normal. And I hope you satisfied dengan apa yang I share in this video. So we'll see you again in another video. And everyone, please take care of yourself. Stay safe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.